Hi, my name is Gordon and today's video we'll go over making a model airplane from a set of plans in a different size than the plans are originally drawn for. For this example, I will use the Yard Ace. The Yard Ace is one of my original designs. The Yard Ace is originally drawn up with a wingspan of 34 inches, a weight of about 10 ounces. What I did for this example was to make a smaller version to use the Park Zone Electronics. The Park Zone Miniature Electronics I know from experience, <clears throat> work with models under a 30 inch wingspan and a weight of under three ounces. I took the plans of the Yard Ace to the local graphics store and made a model with a wingspan of 24 inches. I thought that would be about right for what we have to do. In the video, I'll describe how, as you build over these different size plans, you make the necessary adjustments with dimensions, wood sizes, etc., to accommodate for the different size. The advantage of doing this is that you can take a plan for any model airplane and make a model of any size you want, smaller or bigger. It takes a few adjustments as you build it, again, which I'll cover in the video, but it's a great advantage of building from a set of model airplane plans to have an almost unlimited variety in the size of models that you can make from those plans. The Yard Ace was actually my second design. This is the original prototype, a little bit larger engine, NICAD batteries wingspan smaller than needed. You can see the size of the engine, the small model, the servos mounted on the side. These are the plans for the version of the Yard Ace uh, in this video. Uh, the two fuselage sides uh, shown built over the plans. And again, just making adjustments as you go along with the wood size uh, for the finished model. The one change I did have to make was make the fuselage a little bit wider than necessary to include uh, the electronic speed control brick. You see the brick installed here in the fuselage. Uh, details of the engine mount uh, on the front of the airplane and the finished fuselage in this view. The completed airplane uh, shown here, X Acto 94, an idea of the size. At the field, getting ready for a flight, and you can see the wing held on by two rubber bands. Side view of the Yard Ace uh, coming up on the top view. Everything all set for the first flight. Details of the engine mount, uh, the landing gear, more for prop clearance than anything else. Notice the battery and a lead fishing weight underneath the motor mount to uh, have the proper center of gravity location. The airplane flies well, responsive, and a few flying shots now to close out the video.